Hi, welcome back. Chris here from Keystone Lawn and Tree Care's YouTube channel. And today we're down at Planet Turf to see what these guys are all about. Let's go inside. All right, we're inside here at Planet Turf and we have Jordan here. And Jordan is the account manager. And Jordan, tell us a little bit more about what uh, you guys are all about here. So at Planet Turf, uh, we're built to help professionals like you, Chris, uh, succeed in your plant nutrient needs. So, for example, we have really high-end granular uh, fertilizers, and we also have high-end liquid fertilizers, and we have everything in between uh, that you would need in that scope, plus herbicides, plus plant growth regulants. So uh, we're basically we're here to help professionals that deal in landscaping and the turf industry be successful. Jordan, you got a lot of stuff here. Tell me a little bit about what's going on here. So, uh, Chris, this is basically our show and tell corner where we would bring a professional like yourself that's interested possibly in one of our products and be like, hey, this vial right here, for example, is what it would look like if you pop one of these bags open. And uh, this is why it's this color. These are what these uh, minerals mean inside of here. And so it's just a way for us to give you a visual aid as to what's going on in our products. Hi, Jordan. You know, when I'm looking at this product, I see this on all the bags of fertilizer. There's these three numbers here. This one it says Premium Blend Fertilizer, Nova Green, 24-0-10. What does that mean? So each fertilizer that has an NPK analysis, what I mean by that is uh, nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium, uh, it kind of bears its purpose from those three numbers. Because basically what it's saying is this bag that is a 50 pound bag, 24% of it is nitrogen, 0% is phosphorus, and 10% is potassium. So where this comes into play is you, for example, Chris would come to me and be like, hey Jordan, I've been told in all my research that I need to put out a pound of nitrogen per thousand square feet uh, in, in each application. What does that mean or look like? Or, what does that what is that what do I do with that information so what that would mean is you would need to put out four pounds of this product Nova Green per thousand square feet in order to get one pound of nitrogen because four pounds a quart, you know is a quarter percent 24 percent is a quarter of a hundred so you would need four per pounds of this product per thousand to get one pound of nitrogen and how, how big is this bag? How heavy is this bag? This is a 50 pound bag. Okay. So if, uh, you know, quick math off the top of my head, basically it could do two or two and a half, five thousand square foot houses with one bag. This particular product, Nova Green, is a three to four month slow release. So you would put this out and not, and technically depending on the sun and the amount of rain we get, not have to go and fertilize for another three to four months. Man, that's great. And how much does a bag of this stuff cost? So this particular uh, blend is twenty nine fifty a bag. Uh, where people kind of get shocked maybe with, hey, that's a lot. But then I remind them that actually, for a professional like yourself, that could uh, cover two applications. That's cheap. Yeah, that is Thir cheap. 30 bucks and my applications are like 50, 60 bucks. And you're telling me I can get two applications at least out of this one bag? Yes. yes. So I'm going to be making like 120 bucks maybe off of a $30 bag. I know. So let's back the Brinks truck up. You Man, know I mean? that is a win-win situation. Jordan, as we're talking about these products, you know, down here on the label, I can see that there's a little bit of iron in there. And, you know, I'm a little bit freaked out by it because I've made some mistakes in the past where I've just cranked it out and I've oversprayed all over the sidewalk. And then there's these little tiny rusty kind of brown spots all over the place. And man, I got in trouble. The homeowner was not happy. So I don't know. Should I buy something like this? Is it safe? Yes, it is. And here's the thing that you as a professional need to ask your representative. Even if you don't come to us, it's a smart idea to talk to your fertilizer rep and be like, so does this iron stain? Yeah. And what that means by it is, you know, you're perfect example Man. I was you know spraying a guy's backyard that had a pool one little drip you know of one little prill of fertilizer fell next to his pool instantly brown on his beautiful deck yeah. what, what do I do now so what's kind of cool is in this technology that's in this particular blend which I can kind of show 
a vial of it. I don't know if you guys can see it, but uh, each prill is covered in a non-staining uh, iron coating. So this particular fertilizer with this amount of iron will not stain. Oh, that's Sidewalk good. Sidewalk or anything. So, and I, I mean, this winter I went out, put this out on my lawn because Side note, it's good to feed your lawn during the winter. Okay. And I just left it out there and I didn't even blow off my sidewalks and I got no staining anywhere on my around my property. Oh man, that sounds so, great. So it's always good to ask that question uh, because you don't want to be out there scrubbing something that you can't really clean off the ground, right? So yeah. I don't know if you've had to scrub iron stains, oh, but have. they don't come off. I have, they never come off. I do want to say that we're here strictly for the professional and we want to help serve them and help them make money, we will point homeowners in a different direction if we can. Sure. Okay, so so uh, if you're shopping at Home Depot, for example, that's kind of for your weekend warrior, but Planet Turf is for your professionals like me uh, serving the, the customers. And we kind of talked about that last week, Jordan. We talked about, you know, uh, they're starting to sell this product. Uh, in some of the smaller hardware stores and Jordan says, Hey, Chris, I don't want to get you mad, man, but we're starting to sell this stuff in hardware stores. And I say, you know what? That's okay. Because my target audience is not going to go to the store and buy a bag of fertilizer yeah. and, and do it themselves. That's yeah. why they hire somebody like me. Yeah. So really this is like a win-win, you know, like yeah. I still can buy product here and I can just, you know, fertilize stuff. And then, you know, the homeowners, they, they can go to, you know, your local hardware store and maybe buy a bag of this for themselves and yes. do it for themselves. Yes. So it's kind of a win-win situation. Yeah, it totally is. Man, there is a lot to fertilizer here, Jordan. We have these three numbers. You explain what those mean. You got iron and well, what's all this other stuff? You got sulfur, you got, what is this stuff here? So plants basically eat the periodic table. What? And, and you, I know, that it's mean? crazy. Like, you know, in uh, your high school uh, science class, they had you memorize this huge map that, yeah. you know, just had all these different elements on it, right? Sure. So, for example, whenever you're buying a fertilizer, you need to look down at the fine print, so to speak, and it'll say sulfur, X amount of percent. What's that mean? So why do we want sulfur? So here's the other thing. Sulfur is the flip side or the other side of the coin to nitrogen. Okay. In order for a plant to uh, uptake nitrogen efficiently, it really likes to have sulfur with it. It's kind of like meat and potatoes. You want them both together at the same time, right? Yeah, sure. Or uh, chips and salsa. You don't oh, want man. just chips, you want salsa too, Come right? Come on, yeah. So if you have sulfur, uh, your uptake of nitrogen will be way more efficient and you'll get a deeper green. Okay. So now, now you're speaking my language. You know, yeah. a lot of this stuff is kind of going over my head. I mean, yeah, this, sorry. Is, this is some big stuff. Sorry. And so that's why it's important to come down and, and talk to these professionals because you know, it's kind of a win-win, you know, you come in here and they can tell you a lot about what this stuff means. And maybe I don't understand every single thing that Jordan here is talking about, but he can sell me the correct product given the time of year. And I can come to Jordan and I can be like, hey, you know what, I'm having this, that, and the other thing, problem with the yard, what can I do? And he can just say, buy this product and I'm away I go. Yeah. And, and it's, it's just a great thing. So while I might not know everything, these guys here at Planet Turf do. Yeah. What do you have behind this door? Is this your warehouse? What kind of great stuff do you got in here? Let's just say it's where grandma keeps the cookies. Well, here we are in the warehouse and man, you have got a lot of stuff going on here. I see we have a herbicide granules here beside me. Over there, it looks like you have something that'll treat a fairy ring. And wait, no, and over here I see you have some sort of ground clear product. And then we have grass seed over here and over there, you have pallets of liquid fertilizer too. Man, there's so much stuff going on out here. I, I, I don't, I'm overwhelmed. Jordan, what's going on out here? Well, Chris, you could say that this is the pharmacy for your turf, where whatever needs your turf has, whether it's sick, it's got a fairy ring or a necrotic green spot. It has a infestation of like chinch bugs or other forms of uh, pests, or it, if it just needs to eat well and just be fed well. We do really have what you would need and we're able to help you figure out what you would need. Uh, Chris himself has sent me a picture where he was like, hey, this bush that I love is dying, what's going on? I wasn't really able to figure it out, but I was able to get him an answer from a guy I do know. And so we just like being able to help and provide what you need. Yeah, provide what you need. You know, that's important that you say that because 
here at Planet Turf, they also offer classes that you can take to learn about these products. And not only that, you actually get credit for it. As a licensed professional, I have to continue to go back to school and take these classes. And Planet Turf gives those classes for free to continue my education so I can keep them up to date on my pesticide license. And that's awesome, you know. And we had, like he was saying earlier, I had a problem with these things and I didn't know what to do and I could take a photo, I could send it to Jordan and Jordan could, you know, identify the problem and get back to me and then say, well, you need to buy this product. And I think that's important too. You know, we're, we're business professionals. I'm going to buy my product somewhere. Mm -hmm. You know, if it's not at Home Depot, it's going to be somewhere else yeah. or whatever. And so I want to develop a relationship with you guys to make it a real win-win situation. You guys are in business to make money and so am I. I can come down here and buy my product from you guys, get a lot of great advice, and turn around and sell it at full price and provide the service to the customers too. Yeah, yeah, and, and that's the thing, right, is if we're all making money, we're all putting food on the tables, we're all having a warm house to sleep in. Yeah. And, that, and, and it's kind of crazy, like Planet Turf specifically, we're the only small family-owned business in the Pacific Northwest that is actually competitive in this industry. So it's kind of cool that way. So what I like about it is it's a mom and pop shop helping another mom and pop succeed. And it's yeah. a great story, if you ask me. And we are, most of these products actually, like for example, this herbicide, uh, weed and feed comes from Portland, Oregon. Oh, our, our, our seed comes out of Portland, Oregon. Our liquid fertilizers come out of Walla Walla. We, wow. And so we actually source most of our fertilizer in the Pacific Northwest. Oh, wow. So it's a very cool place to come and hang out and to come and meet people and learn and participate in being successful. Plus, we love Chris. He's awesome. He knows what he's doing. Hey, well, speaking of which, I want you guys out there in YouTube land, I want you guys to check out Planet Turf. I want you guys to like their page. You're going to like my page. You're going to subscribe. You're going to like. You're going to leave a comment below. And with that, we're going to wrap things up and say thank you again, Jordan. My pleasure, you. Chris. Come by anytime, buddy.